So now let's see how we can download files and manage download list inside of Google Chrome. So to do that, first of all, I'm going to navigate onto a website where I can download something from. So, so in this case, I'm going to go around onto the URL address bar right here. And then I'm going to go around and type in, let's say, for example, Handbrake, which is a video conversion software. So you can see that I have this web page right here. I can click on this and then here you can see that there is a download option. So in order to download the file, simply click on this. And what happens is that you have the download right here, as you can see. And depending on your internet connection speed, you have the download. If we were to click on this, then what happens is that it opens up the application. So this is an installer right here. So what happens is that it opens up right here. In my case, I've already installed this software. So you can see that this is what I have. And I'm just going to uh, cancel this installation out because I do not want to install this right now. So that is how you can download this. Another thing that I want to do is let's say I'm going to download VLC Media Player. So I'm just going to go around on to the VLC Media Player website and click on download VLC. And then what happens is that it starts downloading that out right here. So you can see that uh, it's processing and depending on the internet connection speed again, you can see that there's the download. So if I want to see uh, the detailed version of the download, I can go around into downloads and you can see it right here. So there's the download right here. These are the downloads which uh, has been downloaded uh, recently right here. So this is uh, downloaded today and in other dates, as you can see. So you can scroll down to see how that actually looks up. Looks up. If I were to click on show in folder, then it opens up the default folder where the download uh, files are stored. So you can see that in my case, it is in the downloads folder. So both of the files that I downloaded is here. I can close this out and I can uh, click on the cross button to remove it out from the list. But just because you remove it out from the list does not mean that the download file, download file is deleted. So uh, it means that it's just removed out from the Chrome list. So uh, you don't see it here, but it is still here. So let's take another example right here. So let's go ahead and download, let's say, for example, Ruffles right here, which is a bootable device software right here. So if I were to click on this, then this gets downloaded right here. So as the file gets downloaded, what you can do is you can click on this to run. Or if you were to click over here in this little icon, then what happens is that I get options. So I can open this out or I can choose to always open files for this type. So if you want the these type of, let's say, executable files to open up every time, you can choose this one, which I do not recommend because like uh, it'll, it'll, it'll automatically open up files even if you don't want them to. And another option you have is show in folder, which takes you directly to the download folder and you can see the other downloaded items as well. And that is how you can download files and then manage download list inside of Google Chrome. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.